Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and my does this. Welcome or welcome back to another Pokemon Celebrations Pro 2 Master Set. Today, I'm going to be opening up this Pokemon Celebrations Elite Trainer Box. So, without further ado, let's get it. That's per usual, guys. I'm just gonna open the, the box, grab the stuff out, show you the cold card, and just get cracking into the packs. If you would like to see, if you are a new viewer here and you'd like to see the contents of the box, I have plenty of Elite Trainer boxes linked down in the description down below. And if you'd like to see those, don't check those out. There's always one pack that ends up getting stuck in there. Oh my days. Look at this promo card, guys. What the? It's Ben. Alright, here's your call card. And this is what we're here for. Alright, so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yep, 10, make sure. 2 diamonds of days, 1 of the just going to run across this. Alright. So, again, this is my road to Master Set series. The last two remaining cards that I need, I'm trying to chase through a Celebrations products. So from here on, if I if it's not a new product, I'll use it as my road to Master Set series if I open it. And the cards that I need left will be right down there. All right, so let's get into the packs. Start with Battle Stars. Oh yeah. And door as the first card. Is it better centering than that one to replace it? Nah. Um, and as always, from now on, until I finish them, I'll be giving out a couple of extra cold cards. Alright, so Battle Star, Water Energy, HP Share, Brogly, Tower of Darkness, The Handower. We'll see. Mankey. Nawal. Mantis. Bishop. Let's go! And a full art Carbonite. Carbonite. Woo! Not bad, not bad. First pack magic, guys. First pack magic. I wonder how many packs or how many products Elite Trainer Box is going to take me to actually pull the last two remaining cards that I need to complete my master set. I'm really hoping it doesn't take that long. I'm really hoping. I could easily go the singles route, but I'm not too sure I want to do that. Like, it's fun just trying to chase the last two remaining cards that I need. I know that Mew is going to evade me for a long time, but that chase I kind of don't mind doing. But I'm new to EX. I'm hoping to pull as soon as possible. Yahoo! And we've got our second pack banger. And oh, that would be nice for once in an elite trainer box in every pack to pull at least a V, like an ultra rare. That would be a successful elite trainer box, actually, if that was the case. Yeah, um, I mean, the Mewtwo EX is kind of cheap anyway, so. Fine, that would be not really a problem. The Mew, to be honest, I think would actually be definitely cheaper to high five, pick up as a single, like now. But where's the fun in that? Where's the fun in that? Alright, Wash Energy, Charmeleon, Pinkerchin, Yammer, Lerimia, 
that's cool. Total, Weedle, Futile, and Vivid Voltage is the one that breaks the hit magic. Maybe in the darkness of place. Fire energy. Sorry, hand down, just knocked you over. A thrill, got a fossil, same sage, big luck, temple, spinneret, gun sweet, dance boss, jack of ish, and a hollow pull night. No, let's not do that. And our last farm is great. Let me know guys in the comments down below if you've pulled anything special or I would say any secret rares or alt arts stuff like that in your regular packs Is your luck as bad as mine when it comes to them? Or have you got, are you one of the lucky ones that have pulled big boy cards out of them? Like a and Surfetch So only two ultra rares out of five Moving on to celebrations. Alright, so as per tradi tradition, we are going to bring out the Crystal Ultra Ball. Crystal Ultra Ball will I be pulling one out of the two at least for my master set in this opening today. lie to me again this time so I might actually throw up a little counter for how many times this Pokeball is going to lie to me until it does tell me the truth or until it is right but I think that's the second time now from since the last video link will be in the description playlist will be right here there you go Also, if you, on this video and if you do go back and watch the other videos, if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on, I'd very much appreciate it. It will let me know as well that you guys enjoy my videos. And I'll push to make better content. Well done. Let's Ooh! Go! Team, Mo Team. Team Magmas, well done. As a first pack magic. Not too bad, not too bad. I will take that. And a flying Pikachu, so a double banger as first pack magic. Perfect. I have opened, I would say, I think up to this point, probably a hundred and thirty. Between 120 and 130 packs now from celebrations. And out of that 130, this is my first double of Team Magma's Grabber, which I'm actually surprised about. I've pulled a lot more of the Blast Toys, Venusaurs, Double Umbreons, then. King Magma's Groudon and those kind of cards, which is surprising to me. I thought they would be very easy to pull. Cosmorum. Xerneas. Kyogre. And a full up Pikachu. This time, no. That's it. Rado, Palkia, Veltal, Sovereign. Bird Pack was a third. All I need now, in terms of product to open, I think to actually complete opening every product or celebrations is the V Union and technically the collector's chest would all open that early from the prime collection but on its own 
Where's it from? Yeah, on his own. That's probably the only thing I need left. Those two. And I'm... I'm not... I don't know if I should count the tins. What am I doing? Because I don't even know if I can get my hands on those. But if we count everything, I guess the tins. The big tins. The union and the collector's chest to come out. Left to come out. I should hopefully have the unions coming. I don't know. Ooh! My first double up of a Rashiran as well. The first one. Wow. Finally, kind of. And this one. When you do this, oh, the art. Oh, look at the beauty. Look at that beauty. Oh, my. It looks. I've done this with a Zekron, but it doesn't look as good. Oh, look at that beauty. That is such a beauty. Alright. And the Mew. Halfway through, halfway through. Two classic collections, not too bad, not too bad. Two different ones from the usual that I pull actually as well, so I'll take that. Palkia. Well done. Wow. I'm loving this elite trainer box already. Even though I'm not pulling the ones for the master set, but I would definitely take these. Double dark, that double dark barrier dose, my first double of this one as well. And so I think Pikachu V Max so double bang on this one as well. This Elite Trainer box or more, this is probably my best road two, maybe, maybe. Road two master set so far in terms of pulls. Actually, no, I'm not sure which one it was, but there was one where I pulled three from my master set and one Elite Trainer box. That one is probably my best one. Xenius, Cosmogram, Zephyrum, Lunara. With three packs left, it's not looking too good in terms of master set progression. Cosmog, Evelto, Classic Collection Pepper, and Pan Pikachu. Again guys, if you are enjoying this Road 2 Master Set and enjoying me chase two cards that I need left I'd very much appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on if you haven't already Thank you very much Well done Kyogre yeah. Moving on to last pack guys Again, nothing for the collection, so my Crystal Ultra Ball, that's another one added to the tally of being wrong. Tokyo. Rashiram. Groudon. And the silver layer. Yep. Damn. So another dead end to the road to master set. 
We did, however, get four classic collections. Team Agnes Gradon, my first double, therefore like my tenth double probably. My, another double first timer. And Rashiram, this beautiful card, first time double as well. Not to mention a full art from Battle Styles. That was Battle Styles. Yep. And on that note guys, if you stuck with me to the end, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on. And I will see you on the next one. Peace.